How do you test the fuse with a multimeter? Now it doesn't take an expensive multimeter, you just need one that has resistance on it so you can check the ohms and to see if a fuse is open or if it's actually good. What I mean by open is if the contact on the inside is burnt, then um, the circuit is going to be open. So that would not be good. So we actually sell this meter at oneauto.com. Now we're going to switch this switch to 20K for the ohms. And the difference between these other settings is it just moves the decimal point. So 20, 20K is a good place to start. So with the leads, we're going to take these two protective tips off, just like that. And what you want to do, just make sure the leads are in the correct locations for ohms. You can test the leads, make sure it works. Should go to zero or close to zero, which that's good. And we can take a fuse. You want to make sure you're not on a metal table. We have paper over this, but if you're on a metal table, then you're going to get a false reading. Now we'll just touch both sides of the fuse and check the meter and it, you want it close to zero. Now a fuse, you're not going to have any in between. It's either going to be good or it's bad. Unless you have a vehicle that the fuses are over 30 years old, then you may have some other issues. But with newer fuses, um, you're just going to have either good or bad. So testing that one and that's the same. So when I pull off and then put it back on, it goes to zero, so the fuse is good. Here's a fuse that goes to a multimeter. And if I test this fuse, this fuse is actually bad. So all these fuses, you test the same. So go to the two contacts on the outside. These little glass fuses. And that one's good, and then these are good. Whether it's a 30 amp, 15 amp, or a 20 amp, they all test the same. Even the smaller micro fuses. So that's how you check out fuses with a multimeter. If you need a multimeter or any car parts for your vehicle, check out 1AAuto.com. Thanks for watching. Visit 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts shipped to your door, the place for DIY auto repair. And if you enjoyed this video, please click the subscribe button.